When you first start off in your career, the biggest thing that I see artists do, and I was guilty of myself, is actually comparing yourself to other artists. You know, you log on to social media and you start scrolling on your Instagram and you see beautiful work and more beautiful work and more beautiful work, right? And then you look at your own work and you're like, ugh, why doesn't my work look like uh, this girl? And how, why doesn't my work look like that girl? Well, first of all, you just started doing growth. Okay, so let's start with that. It takes years to get your work up to par, okay? And you're also comparing yourself to people who have been in the industry for years and have done thousands and thousands and thousands of brows. Have you done two, three thousand brows yet? No? Okay, well, slow down because you can't compare yourself to someone who's been in the industry who's been, you know, doing a couple thousand brows already. But really, really what I want us to focus on is this. When we get on social media, we are posting our highlight reel. What does that mean? That artists only post their best work, okay? They're not posting, um, you know, the, the clients that they have with difficult skin, all right? Most times, they're also posting very young clients, 20-year-olds, 30-year-olds that have, like, beautiful skin, okay? So keep that in mind. Keep that in mind that you're comparing yourself to something that's not necessarily real, okay? And so when you're going on social media, be inspired by other people, but never internalize or be hard on yourself because you feel like your work doesn't look like their work, okay? Comparison has to end.